All right. So, do we just continue potioning? Uh, yeah. Let's let's potion, cause are, there's no trainers in Diglett's cave, are there? There's no trainers. Yeah. So like we don't even fight in there, right? True. Yeah. It's just catch capture battles. We get to capture Diglett's. Which I think you need to refill on Pokemon right now. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is just the Pokeball guy, right? Baldby, did you know this huge long tunnel? It was dug entirely by Diglett. Well then. Okay. Are there, like, hidden items in the rocks? Oh yeah, Pikachu's tail, like, wags when there's hidden items, right? Yes. Nothing. That... That's trainer. You might want to heal up. Are we? Oh. Oh, okay, no, it's just closed. Oh, there's Machop in here. Huh. Why don't you challenge the Vermilion City to him? Okay. Well, I guess none of the Pokemon show up this low? They should. Oh, there's Diglett. Diglett. Hey, look at that guy. Yeah. It's a good nose. <laughs> it's a good face. It's just green. This should be well, green with the great ball, I guess. If you want to use pokeballs. Oh. Uh. Ah, excellent. Yeah, you definitely got that. Do it. Mm -hmm. What do we name this Diglett chat? Yeah. You guys get to name these guys. Yeah, this is all you. Well, you guys come up with a name. I guess we'll pro probably end up capturing another one. Yeah, Unless we get lucky and a Machop shows up. Uh, I guess, no, those this Machop... Oh, we got a Zubat. All right. I guess those Machops actually aren't wild Pokemon, they're just, um... Oh, but there's another Diglett. Yeah, but the Zubat showed up first. We're Nuzlocke. You're right. Uh, Diggo? Diggo. Diggo, Diggo it is. Alright, And go then, for it. what are we gonna name the Zubat chat? Gerald? All right. Gerald. Diggo and Gerald. Oh. If the Zubat even stays in the ball. Right. All right. Might need a Nana Berry. Let me give him a Raspberry. Uh, uh, dodging. Stay there. All right. Yay, Zubat. I got into that berry. Yeah. It's nice little bit of extra experience, too, to our Pokemon, right? That's right. Well, you name these guys. I'm going to wipe my hands because I got peanut butter, yeah, peanut all, butter over all over them. them. All over. Ah, delicious. Okay, so let's see here. This should just take a second. Party. Uh, box. Alright, so the Diglett is Kayla's. So we'll favorite that one. And then... Got... After six encounters, you got a shiny Snorlax? Awesome. Catch that guy. So we got Diggo. Much better. Much better. And we've got... There you go. Why, thank you. Gerald. Okay. Don't want to put peanut butter on these nice fixed Joy-Cons. Yeah, nice brand new fixed Joy-Cons. Oof. That HP, though. Yeah. 
Uh, we're, we're fine, though. There's no more trainers, and we can go to the Pokemon Center, finally. You're right. Yep. What am I talking about? Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, I know, thinking from the perspective of, what if we get attacked by a wild Pokemon? It's not a problem. They can't right, hurt us. this game. Yep. That doesn't happen unless you're fighting, fighting like... The legendary birds are Mewtwo. That's like the only time. Yep. And I think, interestingly enough, you can also transfer Milton into this game. Yeah, you can. I think this is mostly a happiness thing, but it could help, right? Because he does the evasion thing. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um. So, do we want to do the center now, or do we want to do the SSN before search? Ooh. That's another thing is, yeah, we have the yeah. SSN, which the SSN should be weaker than that route, right? They intend you to do the SSN first. Whoops. Yeah, we got to use our center carefully, right? Yeah, we only got one use. One use center. Uh, well, after we do this, we get to go to the rock cave, right? We do SSN, Surge. There is a Pokemon Center right before the Rock Cave, though. Okay, so I think it's fine if we do it now, right? The Center? Yeah, let's do the Center, hit up Surge, and then do the SSN. Right? You have to do the SSN first, because there's a cut tree in the way. Oh. Yeah. Right. Okay. Um, still want to do well, the Center first? Ugh. <laughs> right. So Surge is going to be harder than the SSN. Oh, let's... I think we can do the SSN. Gloom's running low on H or PP, but we've got some ethers. And we got plenty of potions right now. So I think we're good. Let's get some more potions while we're at it. Okay. Get some super potions. Okay. Uh, talk to the man on the bench. I think he gives you a ride Pokemon. He does, but we don't have enough Pokemon captured to actually get the ride Pokemon from him was the problem, right? Yep. Yeah. Based on our rules there, in order to get it, you'd have to catch five Growlithe, and our rules are to only catch one each. Each of us gets one per route, so yep. yeah, he won't give us the ride Pokemon yet. Um, I'm gonna sell this revive since it's useless. Yeah, you in might this as run. well. We can't use it on the run. Look at all those Pokeballs. Uh, SSN is hard. You rival as a Pidgeotto that has Roost. Oh, right. There is a rival battle on the SSN, isn't there? Yep. Uh, I think maybe we'll be okay. I mean, the Pidgeotto is a problem for my Gloom. Yeah, the Gloom specifically. Yeah, but I do have Nidor Rana <laughs> still. Nidor Rana. Nidor Rana. So I think we'll be okay? It's... I mean, I don't think the Pokemon Center is going to help us as far as like our team composition, right? So nah. it's just a matter of being healed up. And just drop a few potions down on our Pokemon. Definitely, definitely your Pokemon need it. Yep. <laughs> uh, Zara has a lot to catch up on. Mm -hmm. Alright, we gotta keep Pidgeo around. I wanna see Mega Pidgeot. You wanna see Mega Pidgeot? Yeah, doing those crazy hurricane things. Uh, alright. I guess, you know what? Ether up my Absorb on Gloom. And I'm sure I, this is where you want to use the Ether. I think this is a good place to use Ether, right? We should get Absorb back up. We still have a few of them, and that's enough to fully heal absorb. Or, no, not fully. Never mind. I didn't realize it was 15. Alright, uh, let's do it. To the SSN. It's down this way? Or which way was it? 
It's over here? I think it's over here. Here it is. What's he have to say? Yes, Suzanne is a famous luxury cruise ship. It visits Vermilion Port just once a year. Oh, I think there's a rest bed on one of the rooms, too. Oh, is there? I think so. Oh. Well, even better, then. Welcome to the SSN. But not so fast. Do you have a ticket, young lady? You flash your SS ticket at the man. Yep, that'll do. Welcome aboard the SSN. Oh, and that's not all. You're the 100th guest to join us aboard the SSN today. So here you go. Please enjoy this breezy outfit as you feel the salty air on your skin. Great. Alright. You know, for the sake of being fun. Put on one of the outfits. Yeah, let's do it. Alright, what do we got? We got a few outfits, I feel, I think we at this point. we have a few point. outfits. Uh, yeah, put it on you, I guess, right? Ah, you can choose... Sports, Sailor, or Pikachu. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's that's kind of cool. Look at that. It's funny. You can dress up like yellow. Like yellow? Yeah. That's what she looks like. Uh Sailor cap. <laughs> shoes. Sailor shoes. Uh all right. Sailor bag, apparently. Sailor everything. All right, there you go. I could also you could dress up Pikachu dress too. Up Pikachu. All right. Sailor cap. <laughs> yes. There you go. Sailor Pikachu. There it is. There it is. All right. We're all set now. Yeah. <laughs> Guess it doesn't affect me. That'd be funny if it did. It would be. Yeah, there it is. Is the truck still there? Was it? I don't know. I didn't see it. Uh, I have Pokemon Eevee, but Eevee is cool and all, but Pikachu is better. You're more of a Pikachu person? I think the only way to check if something was cut is you had to, like, switch in a Pokemon that had cut. In this uh. case, it's impossible because of Pikachu's the one that has cut. And well, Wasn't, like, the whole thing was you, you, surf. you got through the SSN? Whoops. And then you use, like, Dig or something to get out of the SSN, or you feigned on purpose or something? Oh, now I'm sailored up. Um, oh. You feigned okay. on purpose or something, and then, like... Oh, there you are, Sora! Was that what it was? Like, you feigned on purpose? I think that's what it was. Thanks again for the ticket! This ship There's, is look. huge, and it's full of trainers, so look. yeah, there he is. He's gonna mock him! Probably. That's the real one. Yeah. That's the... That's the, that's the fake guy. Imposter, Gary. Bonjour, if it isn't Sora and Gary. Didn't think I'd be seeing the two of you here. Hey, Blue. Are you taking your cruise? <laughs> Not hardly. I got invited to the exclusive party for trainers, but I'm pretty much done with this scene. I got plenty of party favors, too. Here, I can even share one with you. Shallow or Sable. What? Wait a second. What? I realized something. What? What if this is supposed to be like a parallel story? Yeah. Like alongside like red and blue. I mean, it could be. Yeah. It could be happening around the same time. Like what if you're doing it alongside them and the other stuff is just happening? Yeah, it might be. Like that sudden realization came to my mind. Yup. Because he didn't talk about being a gym leader or whatever. Yeah. I, didn't he say he was the champ, though, already? He didn't say he was a champion. Okay, so he when you get to the end, do you shot. fight Green or do you fight Gary? Is he the champion or is... He I never made it that far. Oh, you never beat this? I never beat it. Oh, well, I guess that'll be a surprise for us, I, I guess. 
What, what does this item do? Red, if it's red, then it is parallel. I mean, it could be. Yeah, maybe it's red instead of... Because remember, he was champion for just this very, very, like, instant. Yeah, red until showed Red up. showed up and stole it away from him. More importantly, though, you want to know what I overheard at the party? You guys know about Team Rocket, right? <laughs> They're the bad guys. I battled them before. Seriously? You must be fearless or something, kid. <laughs> Anyway, the point is this. Team Rocket is a dangerous group, and they're trying to use Pokemon to make themselves rich. I might do some digging into what it is they're really after. You two better stay out of their path. There it goes. There it is. Oh. <laughs> Alright. It would be really funny as if you also saw Red. It would be funny if you saw him as you were going along. He'd be silent, though. He would be. All right. The passengers are restless after being out uh, to sea so long. We might get challenged to battle by some of the really bored ones. So, did Gary not have anything to say to us? Team Rocket, huh? Sir, if you get tangled up with those jerks again, you should call me. <laughs> okay. What uh? What does the shallower sable do, or whatever we got? It's in the medicine bag, right? It's a cookie. Yeah, hey, what is that? I don't know. Calcium can be used to heal all status conditions. Okay. Cool. It's like a full heal, basically. Yep. Uh, I guess let's check out each of the rooms. All right, what's this lady got going on? You look tired. Would you like to take a short rest? Oh, 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 okay, this no, is our no. heal. Does she give us the option? Nope. All right, oh. well... <laughs> Wasted our, uh... We wasted our other... Our one rest here, anyway. I'm glad everyone's looking refreshed. Oh, I'm sorry for fussing over you. Just because you look like my little sister. Do we look like our little sister? Alright, well, that's that. Did, maybe there's something in the trash can. There's never anything in the trash can. <laughs> Alright, fine, I'll check. Let's see. Alright. Nope. nope. We wasted our We ether. wasted our heal because she didn't give us an option. Alright, well now... She asked and then she just did it. Yep. There is no consent, lady. You insolent pup, how dare you barge in? Because you Ooh. see, you see you talk to them. Yeah, and then they fight you. So you wouldn't even know if she was a battle or not. I didn't know. Yeah, we wouldn't have known. All right, we're gonna have a bunch of fire Pokemon here. Maybe I should change my front because we're gonna have a lot of like gentlemen on this boat, right. right? But for this battle, it is what it is. Oh, okay. Man, Pidgeo. Pidgeo. Uh, what levels? What was this guy? 18? He's probably gonna attack my side though, right? Probably. So let's switch in Nidorana. Then we'll put Crobat in the front. Uh, this is no consent, Anne. Yeah, exactly. Nidorana. Yep. It's a good call. Alright. Uh, let's double kick it. It's a strong growl. Growl with. It is. Pretty tanky. I mean, granted, I don't have stab on those double kicks, but... Uh, people battle you without asking. They heal you without asking. Rude. Exactly. It is pretty rude. It is pretty rude. It's not cool. Uh, bite? There we go. That took care of him. Did you...
Yeah. I want all special attack on this Pidgey. Pidgeot. Pidgeotto. Oh. Yeah. Roost. Oh, Roost. Excellent. Oh, nice. Growlithe's got some balance stats. Hmm. Yeah, I figured he was kind of on the balance side. Leaning slightly towards special attack, I guess. Oh, so thanks for the follow, Fire. Yes, thank Much you. Much appreciated. Yeah, level 23 Scallion. Good. He's gonna be real good against Surge. Humph, you rude child! You have no sense of courtesy! <laughs> oh, he actually leans towards physical? Oh, interesting. The Growlithe? Yeah, apparently Growlithe is more of a physical fire type. I, I guess I could see that with, like, Fire Fang and, like, Flare Blitz and stuff. It's true. Wish me left alone. Get out. Uh, let's uh, swap up the order of a Pokemon. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, because Gloom's There's gonna also be... going to be lots of water types from Sailors and stuff. Well, I mean, with... Well, yeah. My Welsh Corgi. You, your Welsh Corgi in general probably isn't great here. I right? Focus on Pidgeo. Pidgeo! Pidgeo. And then uh, put, my, put my Crobat up front. I think, uh... I like how you named it Crobat. Yeah, it's Crobat. <laughs> of course. Yeah, I want to get him a little stronger. Balance out a little bit. So there should be, like, Zubat and Pidgeot. Uh, Growlithe and Ponyta lean a little towards physical. He can... They can mix attack. Okay, so they're kind of in the middle. Yeah, there's Zubat. Yeah, there he is. All right. Beautiful. Look, Look at this, this guy. guy. lounging. What, does he... Does he think that the, uh, the picnickers are gonna come? Picnickers? Yeah. Why is that? He wants the picnickers to come. He wants the picnickers to come? Yeah, he wants to watch them. Look, look at that pose. Yeah. Staying in bed doing nothing during my much-awaited cruise trip. Ah, what a luxury. Okay, he's he's fine. He's not doing anything. The picnic girls are the young ladies. That's true. Yeah. Look at that plant. Is that Dugong portrait? Is it? Yeah, it's Dugong. Oh, And there's Shelder. Cool. Shoulder. And I don't know what this one is. It's nothing. Uh, it's the water. Just water? I like little details like that. Yeah, I think that's pretty neat. Actually, I should check the other side. Yeah, let's check the other rooms. I like all his little ears are poking out. Here, Pikachu's. Oh, yeah, pretty cute, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cute. Not gonna lie. Look at this the beauty. She, she's definitely gonna fight us, right? Waitress! Yes, you waitress! I need a slice of cake! <laughs> the finest custard cake you have! Okay, I guess she she's not gonna us. fight us. Okay. Nothing, nothing in that garbage can. But they're wearing red like that. And yes. It kinda sorta reminds me of Panty from Panty and Stalking. I mean, she kinda does, you're right. Yeah. I can see it. Yeah. Yeah, what's in here? That's a big old tub. wiggly tub. That's really big. Yeah. Are they are they usually that big? Uh, I don't know. I think so. I think wiggly tub's a pretty big Pokemon. I always travel with wiggly tub. I never leave home without it. What is this gentleman? What is he? A world cruise is so elegant and nice. <laughs> That's all I had to say. That's all Useless I had to room. Say. Done with your catch combo. Now this one, on the other hand, wants to battle okay, me. Okay, anything good? <clears throat> I collected these Pokemon from all around the world. Oh, good. What do what do beauties usually have? They usually have like cute Pokemon, right? I think so. Did you? That's not very intimidating at all. That's cute, though. I love Pidgey. Okay. I did always like the black bits around its eyes. Yeah, I think that's pretty cute. Wing attack, we're just gonna... Yeah, good bite, I guess. It, uh, flying doesn't resist flying, though, right? So I'll go for the stab. 
I think it's just neutral. It's just neutral. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's just using wing attack. Yeah. Wing attack all around. Yeah, wing attack party. Okay, you are Either faster, track. right? Ugh. Obviously, since you went first. Yeah. So, Let's do a quick attack. whatever guarantees. I went after, though, right? Yeah. Quick attack's 100% chance to hit, right? Yeah. Just slightly worried here. Well, actually, it did less than half to me, right? Mm hmm. So, I should be okay. And quick attack should kill it, anyway. There we go. Doesn't that be surprised? Yep. <laughs> okay, Welsh Corgi. I, I thought it. Crobat was gonna level up here. He's so close. Pikachu. Oh, that's Back nope. Against both nope, of that's us. bad. That's real bad. What is the season one Ash and Brock double battle? <laughs> yeah. Right. Can you tell me a Pokemon to shiny hunt? What's Pokemon that they should shiny hunt? That they should shiny hunt in Kanto? Yeah. A really cool looking shiny? Yeah, what's a cool mm. looking shiny in Kanto? Mm. Yeah, Charizard was definitely a good one. Yeah, um, I guess they got plenty of Charizard though. I guess though. they got plenty of Charizard. Yeah. Oh man. Let's see. I remember a lot of the, like, the Kanto shinies weren't that interesting. Oh, shiny... Shiny Ponyta looks cool, oh, right? Oh, Shiny Ponyta was cool. Yeah, yeah. Shiny Ponyta there you was go. real cool. That's one. Yeah. Because I had the blue fire. Yep. Makes it hotter. <laughs> ah, yes, you're right. It's stronger. Uh, I guess Welsh Corgi probably would be best because Ozara's going to die. Ozara's going to die. Ozara's not doing a very good job leveling up. No, it's very slow. It's a female Pikachu, just like mine. Yeah, it is. You're right. I guess Nidorana. Oh, no. Yeah. Scallion, duh. Yeah. Scallion. Yeah. Scallion's. Real good for this. Whatever shiny is blue. Well, there you go. Shiny Ponyta gets blue fire. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, so there you go. Tiny. Two damage. I'm surprised that she didn't make it do an electric attack, considering that we had. <laughs> yeah, we had two flying. flyers out. Hey, uh, acid. <laughs> Guess nope. that hurt you slightly more. <laughs> yep, AI picking random moves. That about covers it. All right, Crobat's got to level up now, right? You would think so. Watch, it just doesn't. I'd be very surprised. There, we, there go. we go. That's the way. What, when does it evolve to Golbat? In the 20s. Is it in the 20s? Oh no, I went around the world for these. Went around the world for a Pidgey and a Pikachu? Yep. 22, you think? <laughs> Probably something like that. Too far off. I think uh, that kid's going to battle kid's gonna, You might want to heal. As she tells me about healing. Yup. Yeah, Night Arena was getting a little uncomfortably low. Okay. Yep. Oh yeah, there we go. I think that lady just talks to us though. I, I love, love Pokemon. Pokemon, do you? Well, uh, what's your rule on buying items in Marts? Do you only allow a certain amount of buying trips? Uh, we haven't put any rules on that. Basically, it's just if we run out of money, we yeah. can't buy anything. Granted, it seems like it's pretty strong, too. Just being able to heal like that. We could put a cap on our... We could put a cap on it, I suppose. Like, maybe just, like, one Pokemart visit or something. Make it count? Yeah, like, make it count as well. 
Um, it's just I'm going to be uh, strong against it, so this should do a lot of damage. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> All right, bye, Mikey. Wow, you're great. There <laughs> we are. Funny enough, I actually did not uh, get captivated by Pokemon when everybody first started talking about it. I was like, oh yeah, this is going to be some fad. I don't know. It's kind of cool, I guess. And then it was, uh... gripped you later. Oh, it, it gripped me real hard. We're cruising around the world. My children and I. <laughs> so the beauty is supposed to be her kid or something? Yeah, maybe you're like her older teen. Her older daughter. Because, <laughs> yeah. like, everybody was talking about Pokemon when, like, Red and Blue first came out. It was, like, 98. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was, like, right there. Everybody, like, really got into it. My friend called me up on the phone and was telling me about this Pokemon that she thought was named, like, Puchachu. Puchachu? Yeah. I'm an agent for the International Police. I'm on the trail of Team Rocket. They're up to nothing good. I see. And then she drew me a picture of Bulbasaur. Yeah. And then, um... She showed me her blue version. And that's when my fr my other friend showed me red. It's like, okay, okay, this is, this is interesting, this is cool. Yeah. It's like around that same time, like, yeah, my one friend showed me red, and then she showed me blue. <laughs> I'm like, all right, all right. This is you got the neat. rounds. I started getting the rounds, yeah. <laughs> and um, and the thing that really got me though was, I distinctly remember a Pokemon Snap commercial. Uh huh. And seeing like, it was either Charmeleon or Charizard. You just needed like, a dragon to get you. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, that that got me. Yep. That got me real good. Mm -hmm. And then when I started learning about Pokemon cards, which was the following year, I was like, yo. You were really into that. Yeah, because like, well, the funny thing is, is my friends, they started giving me like random Pokemon cards because I didn't know like where to buy them or anything like that. They just randomly like gave them to me. Mm -hmm. And, um. Bonjour, I'm the waiter on this ship. I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, the strong silent type, Trabian. <laughs> nice. It was a year later, because the card game came out in 99. Uh. It was not until 2000 that I really got into the TCG. It was when the Gym Heroes expansion came out. That was the fifth set. The fifth set, and that's, fifth that's set. what really got me. The fifth set of the Pokemon TCG. Yeah, which I think, ironically, there was quite a few people that were starting to get rotated out of the Pokemon TCG. Uh, There's only quite a few friends that were into it, though. So you had, like, a grouping eventually. Yeah. hum de hum de ho I peel spuds every day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. Can we get any potatoes out of these trash cans? Have you heard about Snorlax? It's a real glutton. No other Pokemon eats and sleeps the way Snorlax can. Snivel, sniff. Onions. Oh, we get to peel onions. Snivel. Yep. Ahem, <laughs> indeed I am the chef. The main course today is... The Cantonian flavor of pewter crunchies. The guests will mutiny, I fear. <laughs> There's an uh, item. item. Are they gonna battle me? They're like rotating around like... Uh, they might. Super repel. Battle like battle types. Let's see. You there, my petites. We're busy here. Out of the way, shoo shoo. Oh, I see the they're, rotating. They're just real busy. That's all. Have you ever wondered about these silver domes we put on top of the food? They're called clutches. They keep hot dishes from cooling. I see. Thank you for the knowledge. <laughs> I'm so busy. I'm getting dizzy. You have to give me room here. Ah, he rhymed. Old game used to get something from the trash can. Yeah, been very disappointed in the trash cans in this game. 
Another portrait of shoulder. And whatever that is. I guess is. they don't want to teach kids to dig in the trash. <laughs> this ship, she's a luxury liner that Pokemon trainers the world over love to get a ride on. Every time we pull into port, we have a fancy party and invite all the best trainers to attend. Great ball, you remember what was in the trash can? I feel like that is the rival battle this way. I don't remember, honestly. Because there was also the basement of the ship, too. There was the basement. There's also up here. This, this looks like rival battle territory coming up. No, it was definitely that way. It was definitely that way? Okay. Our captain is the sword master. He's awesome at using chop down. They say he'll teach his move to anyone who shows potential. I think this is like the outside is of the ship. Is this the outside of the ship? My plan as a kid was to get the great ball in the trash and I would try to catch Doug Trio with it. Oh. Well, now you get a bunch of great balls early in this game. Your Pikachu's excited. Censored wants to see what's up ahead of the ship. Yeah, we named our Pikachu Censored because it wouldn't let us name it Grape Juice. Yep. Because that's what I was drinking when we started the game a few days ago. Hey, matey. Let's do a little jig. I think Pikachu I wants to do a little it. pull of Titanic with us. Oh, does it? Do we actually do that? I think so. I think there's a cutscene. Great. Sailor Edmund. Yeah. yeah. I think the Great Ball in the trash was the first one you could find in the original game, I guess, right? I think so. Alright. I mean, I could switch to Gloom here, but it's probably fine. I think it's I'd fine. I'd rather get more experience on Crobat. Oh, Absorb. Yes. Yes. There we go. That that was my plan. I am glad that the male trainer also went into the sailor outfit. Yeah, that was pretty funny. As long as I like took him out. Yeah. That that wasn't a lot of damage. Nope. You'll probably finish him off though with another wing attack. All right, you have Roost now too. Ow. My personal favorite outfit in this game. You can get the Team Rocket outfit. Oh, can you get the Team Rocket outfit? Yeah. Can buy it and sell it to on. sneak into their, their base? Something. I, it was either that or you could just straight up buy it and sell it on. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. Beat Edmund. Impressive. You took the wind right out of my sails. Huh. What level is Primate? Good question. How many kinds of Pokemon do you think there are in this big world? I don't know, it keeps expanding. It does. There's always more. Yeah. Infinite. Infinity. Infinity. The limit does not exist. Nope. <laughs> the party is winding down. It's about time for the ship to set sail. Imagine if we just stayed on the ship until it set sail and we just got taken out of Kato. Right. Oh, I think this oh, is the Titanic scene. Yeah, look! P. There we go. See? Gaze over the wide open sea together with censored. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Censored seems really happy. I hey, don't do the thing with the, uh, the arms out. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> Gotta do those Pikachu. Oof, I don't feel so good. Came up for some air because I got seasick. He's throwing up. He's throwing up. Did we talk to this guy yet? Oh. Oh, hey there. Do you not get seasick on ships? Nope. We're good. We're good. I get roller coaster sickness. I don't... Oh, no, no. You've, got, you've gotten car sick before. Gotten you car might sick? get seasick. I don't know if, I, if I've ever gotten seasick, but I might... You it's might. Kind of a similar... You haven't really like experienced it that uh, experienced it that much, have you? I was you? like, I was on a ship once when yeah. you were really young. Yeah, when I was very young. It's so hard. It's hard to say. Very hard to say. I've been on a few boats before and I've been fine, but mm -hmm. maybe it's because they fed you. Because you said it specifically when you're not fed that you yeah. get car sick, it's right? True. Seal. How fast is Seal? 
How fast? Yeah, should I worry about my Zubat here? Hmm. Or should I just absorb him and call it a day? Depends how attached are you to Zubat. I'd like Zubat to stick around, preferably. Uh, I mean, you could put a potion on him, too. I could potion him. But I have Absorb here. I mean, <laughs> he's pretty below average on speed. All right, I should be OK. Zubat's fast. Yeah, OK, we're good. Oh, that did nothing. I mean, granted, I don't get stab on this move. It absorbs pretty weak to begin with. Encore. Encore. Okay, that was probably what you were going to do anyway, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> sure, why not? I'll just keep absorbing. Yep. Just hit away damage. Good to note that Seal hasn't oh, done Oh man, growl. Threatening. What's that? Good to note that it hasn't done anything super threatening. Yeah, no, it's done nothing of value. I guess switch to Gust now. I, uh, I'm on cord. Oh, did that last turns. multiple turns? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought that was just one turn. Uh, Seal Dugong are pretty slow and don't hit very hard. They're better with HP and special defense. I mean, I guess, like, the one scary thing is, don't they learn, like, Ice Beam? That could have been bad for us. Yeah. But I guess we're fine. Mm. Yeah, but not this early. Okay. Unless he, like, got a TM. That's true. A chop, which we're also good against, really good and against. your Encore is still helping you in this situation. Yep. So, yeah, here we go. We're both good against it. You'll probably just one-shot it. Oh, no, actually, Not that's surprising. a bulky Machop. Uh, they'll get Aurora Beam first in the 20s. Okay, is that also a nice move? I totally forgot about that move. That's true. Focus it's like energy. a weaker Ice Beam. Oh, man. He's totally going to get a chance to use that move. He's getting Oh, pumped. right, we got growled. That's why we did pit oil damage to him. Oh, yeah, that's right. Bye, Machop. Nice try. I was just careless. Three Pokeballs. Nice. Yes. Uh, Papa uh -huh. told me there'd be a hundred kinds of Pokemon, <laughs> but I think there are more. Oh, there's almost a thousand now. Yeah, there's a lot now. Yeah, add an extra zero to that guy. Uh, does this guy fight us? Ooh, scrubbing Gex is hard work. Oh, nope. is that it? He's done. So I guess we're good. Okay, so we took care of the top there, and we got our nice little Titanic scene. Yep. Uh, do we want to go below deck first? I'm pretty sure that's where the rival is. It's, if yeah. not the well, rival, let's then like go the, to the bottom then, I guess. Guy. As long as we hit up everything here. That's all that really matters. It was all the way on the end here. Whoop. <laughs> He's totally in the way. Just hanging out there. So what does this got down here look like? So we've got a bunch of door. doors. Yeah, all right, just a bunch okay, of doors. So the other room. area was the rival battle. OK, let's keep going. A fisherman. Fisherman. He's gonna have a bunch of match carps for us. Right. Look at this cooler. Hello, stranger. I can't tell if you're from the seas or mountains, but stop and chat. All my Pokemon are from the sea. <laughs> Look at that Marty. face. Yeah, he's real into reeling in nothing. Goldeen. All right. I prefer when they're not just the magic carp fisherman. I like getting experience. Right. Okay. Uh, guess absorb. Have some HP to get back. Mm hmm. Is 
Oh, missed. All right. That's stab. Stab. Oh, ouch. Uh, oh, okay, it was a crit. That explains. That explains it. Okay. Yeah, you're almost there. We'll see. Oh, yeah. Probably would roost, yeah. Uh. Absorb. You know, there's far less gentlemen on here than I was expecting. You're right. Accuracy fell. Oh, nice. that did a lot more than I was expecting. Oh, because I crit. crit. Okay. That explains it. We got a lot of crits recently here. Quick attack. Yeah, you're probably faster. And yeah, wing attack. Oh. Oh. Oh, that actually did quite a bit. Glad I roosted. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Level 18. Up. Assume we're a while from Pidgeot. Yeah, like 36. Bart. Oh, I let that one get away. <laughs> okay. Just thinking I might be able to hook you as a fishing buddy, too. And give us the nah. rod. Here. I think you get the rod in the Pokemon Center in Vermilion. Do you? The first rod. Huh. Could be. Sailor. Item. Sailor and item. Even sailors have Pokemon. So we've noticed. Mm hmm. It's really been mostly sailors. I really should have been sticking to Gloom, I guess, but whatever. Crobat needs to catch up. Oh, Sailor Huey, Side he deck. actually shows up again in Johto. Oh, does he? Yeah, that same trainer. In fact, Typically he even, this like, guy? talks about it being like, oh yeah, I was on the SSN. Ah. Yeah. Oh, that's that's actually cool. Oh. Uh. I guess, I guess Absorb would work on him, too. He has, like, a quillfish in Johto. Does he have a quillfish? Yeah. Change it up? He yeah, changed it up. Doesn't have that Psyduck? Water gun. Oof. Probably should roost again. I guess I'll just wing attack. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, your side duck. And then huh. you send out a cool fish next. <laughs> oh, awesome. Still no moves. <laughs> Polywag. Uh, so I guess you don't have stab anymore on wing attack or anything, right? Uh, that, that hurt <laughs> a little bit. Uh, I think I should switch. No, I guess I'm still good. Yeah. I'm still good. Barely, but I'm still good. Oh, is it only the turn for roost? Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, you're not bad. Alright, what do we got back here? 
We caught all our Pokemon when we were out at sea. Super, Super potion. potion, that's useful, actually. Alright. We have like two more, three more three doors. doors. And yeah, we've got in here. Oh, like oh, this guy. So you want to put your Growlithe up front? She's probably got a Magnemite or something, right? Yeah. It's definitely a switch, uh. Yeah. Welsh Corgi and Scallion. Bring them back up. Watching you just Fisher Diglett. Right. <laughs> I would hope not. Electric Trainer. I like feisty kids like you. What, for breaking into your room? Is that why we're feisty? Dylan? Yeah, oh, awesome. Magnemite. Yeah, it is a weird comment. I don't know what that had to do with anything, but... Uh, acid? Just because it has a million PP. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Fuse ray? Sure. One to one confuse ray? I think it's just better than supersonic, isn't it? I think so. Yeah, I chose acid though, cause just because of the PP, because I knew she was gonna one shot it. I'm just literally just wasting a PP with any of my other moves. Cause I end up using the attack regardless. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Which is silly, but that's what that's what happens. Oh, there, there you go, level 12 is our... Ah, I lost it. Okay. Uh, you're all right, kid. You're going to grow up into an amazing adult. What do you think? Think about what? Going up into an amazing adult? Uh, maybe. I mean, I guess red and green do. I don't know about these characters. Yeah. Found a full heal. He probably likes losing to feisty kids, too. Well, he just did. Elixir. Elixir. Oh, Ooh. yes. That is precious. That is a precious item that we shall covet. So I got two more doors. Two more doors. Just, uh, swap her pokes again. Want to keep Scallion? Um, I I still want to catch Crobat up to the rest of the team. So I think let's let's keep him up front. He needs some more experience. I'd like to at least get him up to twenty if possible. I'm gonna drop a potion. Uh, yeah, let's drop a potion. We got him. Okay. No trash can look. You know what they say about sellers? We're all itching for a fight after ages at sea. No. <laughs> Leonard. Alright, Leonard. Slowpoke. Well. Probably going to be easy. All right, he's very bulky, though, right? Yes. Ugh. Anything that's pink is usually bulky. That's the rule. Oh, is that the rule? 
Yeah. Is Ditto bulky? Okay, not really. <laughs> <laughs> well, I suppose out of all of his stats, what are his highest stats? HP, I think. Is HP his highest stat? I think so. I mean, he's weak everywhere, but we're talking about, like, what... In proportion to his other stats. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, what... what oh, is... no, it's speed, I think, is his best one. Where do you say? Oh, he's literally even in everything. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, he's neutral. All right. So not everything that's pink is bulky. <laughs> now we most, know. Most pink things. Yup. Except for Ditto. Ugh. So close. If you drop a roost, because I think I'll kill him anyway, right? Mm-hmm. Gotta make the most. I don't... I don't know what I feel... I don't know what I know about Let's Go anymore, because, like, Roost did not exist in Gen 1. That didn't get introduced until later. Like, yeah, so they kind of, like, sort of they included new choose. things? They pick and chose what was kept and what wasn't. Right, good battle, mate. Yeah, it seems like it's half and half. Because remember when I was, like, holding back on, like, Evolving Weedle because of Bug Bite? Yep, and, then we learned and that it was just a waste because he doesn't learn it for some reason. But then, like, Pidgeotto here has Roost, so I'm like, I don't even know yeah, anymore! I don't know what they were doing. I don't even know anymore. Haha, <laughs> wanna be a sailor, mate? You already are. Yeah. Yeah. This game is, like, messing with my head as to what I remember. <laughs> it's really, like, yeah. Everything you knew about Pokemon, you have to throw away for this one. There's a Machoke. My partner Machoke is super strong. He has enough strength to even shove big rocks out of the way as if they were nothing. Is that a hint he's towards got, strength? Yeah, he's got a strength hint there. Go, go, go. Is, is a Machoke, like, um, referencing what happens to you when you go on steroids? He has like a super squeaky voice, even though he's super mus muscly. Right. Yeah, so don't do steroids, kids. <laughs> you end up like Machoke. <laughs> I see. And then you'll start getting distorted and grow four arms. Yeah. Oof, yeah, you don't want that. <laughs> Unless you want to be like Tien. Yeah, I guess if you want to be like Tien, then, then that's kind of cool. Let's go in this room. Gentlemen. What do you call that the four witches technique? I don't even remember. I've journeyed far and wide, but in all my travels, I've never seen any Pokemon sleep like that one. It was a massive, a huge, round Pokemon. Snorlax. Yep, that was Snorlax. Everyone's been talking about Snorlax here. Yep. Uh, and everyone's been talking about that Blair Witch Project like video. Oh, uh, right? yeah. I think it's a ghost EV, but uh, people are talking about Zora, maybe? Could be Zora. Yeah. It's a Legends Arceus -like trailer that got dropped yesterday. That was very Blair Witch Project-esque. Yep. They're like, oh, look at that Pokemon. I think it's a Growlithe, though. It's a Vulpix. It has a red-tipped tail. Look at those round yellow eyes. It's got silver hair on its head and around its neck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, some people think Zora, but I'm... I'm leaning towards, uh, Ghost Eevee. Ghost Eevee. Fisherman Dale. Magikarp. Here's our Magikarp guy. A single Magikarp. Oh yeah, your Magikarp's still at the, uh, the daycare center, right? It is. Gotta check up on it after all this. Yeah. Never know, maybe it became a lot nicer oh, yeah. drunk. That was one of the disappointing things, is he doesn't have freaking yeah, flail see? in this game. See, that's what I'm talking about. Ugh. It's messing with my head. I don't even know anymore. I know, how cool would it have been to have a flail Magikarp? Although I guess there's no Focus Sash in this game, so that'd be bad anyway, right? True. I don't know why they didn't include include a uh, hold item. They got rid of abilities, but like apparently, like natures are still a they thing. They still have natures. 
It's like some weird conglomeration of things. Yeah, they just like, Pick I don't know stuff. what they were doing. Like it is Kanto, but then it is Pokemon Go mechanics. Yeah. And they have like Mega they Pokemon. They still have like, I'm pretty sure IVs are still in the game. And... Then there's Alolans. Yeah, there's still the Alolan forms. Certain Pokemon Got learn, natures. Like, non-Kanto exclusive moves. Mm hmm So like... It's like, it's all over the Frankenstein place. to get <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what the decision-making process was on this. It's weird. He's hiding an item behind himself here. Party. party! Cruise ship's party should be over by now. We missed the party. This was the party. Yeah. Alright, revive. Still no rival. They show up at the very end. The very end of the hallway. Yeah, like when you're about to go up the stairs. This old guy this here. old man say. Small trees can be chopped down by the masterful secret technique chop down. No, no longer cut or chopped down. I've seen Pokemon ferry people across the water. I really have. That's what Gyarados can do. Gyarados can do that. Mm-hmm. I will say that's one thing that I really liked how they handled HMs in this game, which was that it was just, like, secret techniques on Pikachu, specifically. Like, if they continued that sort of trend, I think, with, like, either certain Pokemon... Like, it doesn't even have to be all Pokemon. Maybe, if, like, certain Pokemon did it even, or, like, if it was too much of a task. I think all Pokemon should just have an HM move slot. That's it. Yeah. That's all it needs, is a fifth slot for specifically HMs for the map. Yeah. Yeah, you've been saying that for a while. Mm -hmm. So it's like effectively sort of similar to what they did with Pikachu in this game. Yeah. Except that Pikachu is the only one that learns all the HMs because it's Let's Go Pikachu. Yeah, I think that's fine, honestly. Because I thought that the... Uh... Competing against the young keeps me youthful. I thought it was kind of cool what they did with some of them, but I thought it was too convenient at the same time. Yeah. Like, I still think like adding a, that level of like, what do I need to bring with me thing was good. Yeah, I think it's a good bad. way to technically force the player to make a balanced team. Yeah. It's like a way to trick them into doing it, basically. Mm-hmm. Granted, that's not always been how it's been, because a lot of them are, like, water and normal. But if they actually thought about it and made more of these moves different types... Yeah. They could kind of force you to make a balanced team. Yeah, we attack it is. Ooh. Ouch. Yeah, that that hurt. A lot. I guess. I guess maybe Zubat yeah. should probably switch out. Yep, I'm gonna switch that guy right out of here. Get out of here, Zubat. We're gonna be Nidorana. Okay, that's, that's more right, acceptable. Yeah, that's not that bad. There we go. Crit. Get that ponyta out of here. Good match. Ah, I feel young again. <laughs> These Pokeballs we get. Great balls from the campers. And these gentlemen can't afford to give us great balls or anything. Fifteen mm -hmm. years ago, I would have won. Uh, drop potion on my Zubat. Yep. Let's see what some of these other guys. Uh, yeah, I guess drop one on Adorana. The other two are like almost full anyway. Yeah, everyone else is okay. Watching that makes all the difference. It could. Which do you find to be more worthy, a strong Pokémon or a rare one? Strong, strong if you're a battler. Rare one only if you're collecting. Yep. I mean, sometimes those things go hand, hand in, in hand. hand. In fact, usually they go hand in hand. Lamar. If I'm going to be completely honest. It's true. 
Sand Shrew. Sand Shrew's not a rare. Nope. I mean, he didn't say he had a rare Pokemon. You're right. He was just asking what we prefer. You're right. I guess. Uh, it's a ground type. I mean, its ground moves wouldn't really do anything against either of us, so that's True. cool. Yeah, we, we attack him, I guess. I know I'm going to absorb. Where's the favor one option? <laughs> Clearly not friends with Agatha. Oh, like... Yeah, didn't Agatha say stuff about, like, she only uses her favorites? Does she say that? I guess so. I, like, that's why they brought it up, right? Yeah, I suppose so. Alright, Sancho. Give us your free experience. I salute you! Okay. Uh, something like, trainers should pick the favorite instead of going for the strongest ones. <laughs> oh, is that what she says? Personally, I prefer Pokemon that are both strong and rare. Sancher is not rare. Nah. No. Nugget. You didn't get a Ponyta? No? Maybe we can oh. start another chain, I guess, right? Oh, there's another set of stairs up there. Huh. Uh, this guy probably won't fight us. He's sitting down, right? Have you been to the Go Park complex in Fuchsia City? That's where the Safari Zone used to be. They replaced it with this thing. Is that how you transfer the Go Pokemon over or something? Yeah, because you can go from Go to Let's Go, but you can't do the other way around except for Milton. I see. Yeah. There were many rare Pokemon there. Me and my daddy love to go parks. So I wish we could go there again. No. No. Yeah, that's how you could get my Alolan Meowth if you really want it. That's true. It's the only way to get it, huh? Uh, except from Eevee version, too. You can get it from Eevee version. Oh, can you get it from Eevee version? You have to trade for it, I guess, right? Yeah. The captain said he's awfully sick. He was looking all pale, too. I hear it's really quite common. People getting seasick, that is. We're not seasick, we're okay. Yeah. Okay, nothing over here. There it is. Right, here we go. Hey, Sora, over here. Look at that face. I know, he's so happy. See those stairs there? The captain's quarters are up there. He can teach you this cool secret technique if you ask him. He's really famous for it. Though, he looked pretty done in by seasickness when I saw him. Seasick Captain, Captain, can you believe that? Hey, before you go to meet him, how about I take a look to see how well you've been raising your Pokemon, huh? Here it is. He's too nice. He is too nice. At least green is actually in the game, though. So it kind of lightens the blow. I thought it was just this guy, and they just, like, completely replaced red and green. So it does help. Yeah. They're sort of teasing you, though, by being like, look, there he is. Yeah, hero. Uh, kind of why I don't like this guy is, well, uh, he's like a more annoying berry from Sinnoh. Yeah. Um, you'll, you'll probably be fine. I'll be fine. I mean, I guess my Crobat will be fine for probably a move. I think. Maybe. <laughs> I guess. Uh, I confuse him. Not the face. Ah! Oh, that was terrifying. Yeah. Ooh. He did confuse it. I though. did confuse it, so that helps maybe. Ooh, that was. That was close. I think you should switch. 
Or heal. <laughs> uh, Hugh and Marty all the way when it comes to rivals. Charon. Charon's the best one. I'm gonna super potion. I personally like Silver. Silver is also really good. He's my, my second favorite. favorite. Yeah. He's my second favorite. Charon's definitely the best though. Yeah. Well, Marty, I liked her. I don't. I wouldn't put her that high up on the list. So you did like Howe's one moment. I did like Howe's one moment. Originally, I hated Howe, but he he turned himself around real hard for me. That one moment. That oh. one moment in Alola when yeah, you're going through the the base of team whatever they are. It was like the Aether Foundation. The Aether Foundation. And the scientist, like, locks the door behind he's himself. Like, <laughs> yep. They're like, the thing. Yep. And he's like, oh yeah, you can't get through without this key. And I was like, <laughs> why why didn't you just not bring the key and then we could have never gotten in? And the scientist is like, shut up. <laughs> I was like, alright, how you're alright. You turned it around for That's me. the one moment that did it for you. Yep. All right, let's see here. Uh, wing attack. Yeah. Don't you like Bede right. too? Yeah, Bede is good. I like Bede. He's definitely not up with Silver and Charon though. They're the best. Specifically, his interactions with um, Opal, right? Oh yeah, Opal's yeah. the best gym leader yeah. ever. Period. <laughs> like that's no question. Boo, attack. We want special attack on this guy. <laughs> Eevee. Alright, no double kick this time. I actually hey. don't remember much about Barry, but I guess we'll be reintroduced because Diamond and Pearl's coming out again. That's true. I mean, he's kind of a prankster because I'm pretty sure he's based off of Pearl from um, the manga, who's like a they're literally comedians. Diamond and Pearl are comedians in the manga. They're supposed to have like some sort of stand-up routine. Marnie's a cinnamon roll, and I really like that Hugh hated Team Plasma and was not out for blood uh, because they stole his sister's purloin. Yeah, black and white too. Yeah, that's right. Yep. Hugh was actually pretty cool now that I think about it. Yeah, he was alright. I wouldn't put him up with Silver and Charon though. This Eevee. I'm suspicious uh, of that double kick. Afraid of this Eevee. I mean, I you'll mean, to be, be fair, fine because you, yeah, you win on flying. But, like, if it's Let's Go Eevee, it could have, like, any type move ever, right? That's what it I'm could, like, a It could hit you of. with electric. I'm a little bit afraid <laughs> of this Eevee. Yup. Ooh! Maybe I should switch in Nidorana for her double kick. Yeah, I think that's I think that's I'll do cool. that. But, I don't know, like, do whatever, I guess, right? Because the Eevee could literally be anything. Switching Night Arana. You think it's just a normal Eevee? I don't so it doesn't know. get any of the crazy let's go moves? It's got quick attack. Yeah, it's feeling like a normal Eevee. Unless you're Eevee from my sun version. Your sun Remember? version? Oh, yeah, that. Eevee was... I mean, you basically just used it for its Z-move, didn't you? Yeah. And then everything yeah. else was... Yeah. It was Eevee and Clefairy. Yeah, it was the Cle Clefairy that did all the attacking. Eevee just set it up. <laughs> could be a, like... It could be a trump card, Eevee. That's true. Yeah. Except it doesn't have any abilities, so it can't be that scary. Even with that. That's Am I like gonna flinch? I'm gonna flinch. I'm gonna flinch, aren't I? Oh no, nope. I didn't. Excellent. Good. Yeah, get out of here, Eevee. Get yeah, out of here. There it is. Yeah, poor, poor. <laughs> poor, poor this. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Uh, 
Haven't gotten a lot of levels on the SSN. I'm surprised. Oddish, uh, huh? He got an Oddish. He it's one level in... away from being Gloom. It's true. He just... got inspired by you. He got inspired by me. <laughs> He's like, let me get an Oddish. Like, yeah, that that Oddish was crazy. Right? Yeah. Alright, this wing attack's gonna do mass <laughs> mad damage. I mean, like, I could just fight it or whatever. Actually, let me helping hand you. Yeah. Helping hand. Ah. There we go. This Oddish is doomed. Bam. Oh. oh it's still alive. I'm surprised. Impressive. He was truly inspired by your Oddish. He was. He was EV training it. Oh, acid hits both? Interesting. Actually, I think I remember us doing, realizing that against uh, Jesse and James, right? Yeah, that's true. I just forgot was all. Wait? Question mark? Ah, super ah. Cool. He's learning. Alright, alright. I'll just helping hand another wing attack then. Let's make this big damage. Yeah. Helping hand. I don't think we have to fight the captain, right? He's too seasick to fight us. He just yeah, he straight up gives us cut, right? Asks us or, to sorry, give him a massage. Sorry, cop down. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you won't battle the captain, yeah. I thought so. Scallion leveled up of all Pokemon. Whoa, whoa, I can't believe it. Yeah, you got nothing on us. Wow, Sora, you, you've gotten pretty strong. Oh, uh, nothing. That's cool. Anyway, go meet the captain. I'm show you his secret technique. I also kind of appreciate that at least he doesn't just get the same team that, whoops, that Green gets. Because, like, at this point, Green has a lot more Pokemon than just that. And he oh, never yeah. even gets an Oddish, right? Yeah, he even had that Raticate that everyone talks about as the reason why um, he went to visit the Lavender, Lavender Town. Town. Yeah. Oh, I feel terrible. Oh, this seasickness has done me in. You rubbed, rubbed the, the captain's, captain's back. back. There, there, old fellow. <laughs> oh, thank you. I'm feeling much better now. So what did you want from me? Oh, you want to learn my secret technique? Of course, I'd be happy to teach it. Come along with me. Pika Pika. Ha ha ha, that Pikachu looks more than ready to learn my secret technique. But I'm afraid it's really only for humans. What's this? You really want to try to learn it, no matter what? Well, color me surprised. I've traveled all over this wide world, and this is the first time I've had a Pokémon want to learn my secret technique. But with spirit like that, well then, who am I to say no? I'll teach my special secret technique even to that Pikachu of yours. Come with me, little friends. Gonna cut down that tree. Now watch carefully. Ha! Ah, da! <laughs> Just like that, you learned it, huh? I will say I do like that they show you, like they give you a visual of what to do. What happens. Yep. Yeah, I think that's good. It's good uh, user feedback, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, you had... Cadabra too? Oh, okay, yeah. Whoa, I really went and learned Chop Down. Using Chop Down, your Pikachu will be able to help you chop down thin trees. You could go give it a try, huh? That's right. How about on the trees around Vermilion City? Whew. Now I guess it's about time for the SSN to set sail again. This may be goodbye for now. Until the next time we return to Vermilion City. Those are the things I've been talking about that I like and don't like about this game. Yeah, it did a few good things, that's for sure. I see. But not really as far as gameplay is concerned. It's all just about, like, user feedback. Yeah, user feedback specifically. Yep. Ooh. Now, now I guess it's about time, time for the SSN to set sail again. It's maybe goodbye for... Okay, it's just the same thing.
A random curiosity strikes me. Oh? Oh, he has a dig. He doesn't have dig yet. We do have the TM. Oh yeah, we do, don't we? Just a lighthearted adventure for those looking to cruise. To cruise? To cruise? Yeah. We're already cruising. Yeah, we are. Another curiosity. You could just escape rope. Okay, okay. Yeah, right. If escape rope doesn't work, then dig won't work. Dig won't they work, yeah. Basically the same thing. It's worth a shot. Yeah, I think it was like you... Well, no, how would you... I guess you just save a trainer somewhere and then lose to him, right? I think what happened, yeah, is you lose to a trainer, then you get, you get um... You Sent get back to a Pokemon gun. Center. You get, get yeah, you get cut Pokemon first, Center. then you lose to a trainer, and then that's all you do, right? Yeah. Yeah. Then you the SSA doesn't go away. Did they, did they do something to prevent that from happening in this game? I don't know if, like, outside of move techniques can be used or anything like that. If you're trying to keep the end, yes. Yeah, that's how you did it, right? Does that still work in this game? Not that there's any trainers left for us to do that on, and it's also a Dazzlock, so... Alright. I don't see why not. The flag might be watching the departing cutscene. Maybe they also just don't cut you off from the water here anymore? Gonna shiny hunt Onyx now? What does a shiny Onyx even look like? Is it like gold or something? Something like that.